we're back. All right, I'm looking at Soldier, but also, what if I just played with one of the characters I've already won with? Listen, I've put it off too long. Masochist. Masochist is amazing. Masochist with the axe for more damage to start? Yeah, let's do it. The Masochist is so good. It does need some armor, probably. And early in the waves, it's kind of weak. I think I got a stat up there. Attack speed's pretty important. Harvesting would be too. Um, just take the attack speed. Take this first, then this. Reroll. Really? Two coupons early. Okay. Yeah, the axe damage is just crazy, even before I've gotten hit much. It can take out, like, limitless enemies. So really, I should probably try and go defense a bit. Or attack speed. Attack speed is kind of like defense. Okay. So I want these things. Everything's locked, so there's no point re-rolling because I have both weapons locked. Why did I take coffee? This coffee's good. And having more weapons isn't really going to help me feed these stats. Yet. I do enough damage. See this horse head? Yeah, no projectiles. I wonder if it's only SMGs. Maybe. Or just ranged, or just weak damage. Um, I do eventually want range damage. Masochist. I want max HP. Melee damage. I think I want economy. 10% attack speed, though. I'm already gonna get this damage. I do want this damage. Attack speed's pretty important. Holy three coupons. Throughout the course of the run, they should save me some money. They've already saved four. Look at how good that is. Free re reroll. The best kind. I'm not going to save the bat, even though I think the bat's good. The bat's very good. I already have lots of regen. We're gonna get an axe level three, which will be amazing. Okay. Hurt me. Yeah, armor so that I only get hit by little hits instead of big hits. And I do want dodge, because this character does get hit a lot. Like, even with dodge, I'm gonna get hit plenty. I do see the tree, but I can't go get to it in time. Kinda stupid, but I have lots of regen. Why not? Is this the time for dodge? pre-roll. Could take the hand just for the harvesting. 
Oh, I'm supposed to combine these up. One damage. Minus 98. Would the hand pay for itself? Cost 15. I think it will. It's wasting one of my roll spots, but I think the hand's okay. Or early. I don't know. Right, I started with one HP. I just need to get hit by these little ones a little bit. So starting with one HP does eat into my damage for the entire wave. It's good to remember. I ended up getting my damage up there. Okay, don't die, but get the tree. I think I could have maybe got a couple more kills if I didn't take start with one HP. Um, yeah, we'll take that. Pick up range, harvesting, minus dodge. Okay. I do want to go defense because we can get kills with the ghost axe. Defense and economy are important. What is my range? My range is 40. Pretty good range. I'm going to lock this. I think I do need to focus defense with this specific character. With defense, I can get unlimited damage. And they will hit harder the further we go. I want to take lots of little hits. I need the scepter so that I can raise my max HP. That hand is not doing much. Talk to the hand. Luckily, the horse heads are not creating projectiles. Yeah, some lifesteal would be nice, because the axe is hitting a lot of enemies. Um, Max HP is good. I need more than 1% lifesteal. I could get my speed up. Or regen, 8 harvesting, wave 6. Go big regen. Big armor. Big knockback. Big bag. Big reroll. Big ghost axe. Everything's big. This does so little damage because I have the minus 88, but this would go up. I don't know if it matters. I'm going to say maybe it does. I'm trying to get my max HP up. Cost 73. We'll take it. Right. I have to get my damage up. Then I can... I have to kill the eggs. I did not kill that egg. Because I don't do any damage. And okay, now I should do enough damage. Kill the bone thing. More luck so that they drop more food would be helpful. Because I am running around in swarms of enemies that would drop food for me. I might be able to kill the elites, though. Crap. Oh, I killed those eggs, I think. The elites don't actually do much damage. Maybe they do if they land those shots. So, right now I'm level 9. I want to pay attention to level 10. I get speed, but it's not a priority. Max HP and armor are... Go max HP. Speed is capped. If this wasn't engineering, I might take it. Especially because I could get my speed up first.
I'm getting the speed up. I could have thought about that taser, actually. 16 harvesting. It's going to be wave 8. But... Okay, I need to take some damage from the little ones so that I can kill the big ones. enough damage. I did take the alien eye thing. Yeah, I need enemies to drop food for me to eat so that I can heal so I can keep taking damage. <laughs> Can't even kill trees. I ran right into where that thing was ramming. Okay, I'm trying to get this food and we'll kill this crowd. I need to check the damage numbers on that alien eye. Because it should be doing decent damage as my damage percentage goes up. Definitely take medical turret. Really good time for it. Um, attack speed versus harvesting. Is it early enough? I think I have to go either armor or attack speed here. Armor has diminishing returns. It's still really good. I think attack speed's better. I'm going to start trying to get more lifesteal. I am. Lose a lot of dodge. Is that really worth it? I'm going to say no. It costs 129 too. Okay, so I wanted to check. One, how much stats have you gained? Not much attack speed. What else do I want to check? 75 materials. These kind of paid for themselves. 34 materials. You're pretty expensive. That's good to know. I got it for free at the end of O level. I wanted to check... Oh, these. 1531. That's actually my second best weapon, is Alien Eyes. And it doesn't take a weapon slot. Okay. That's really good to know. It's a Ghost Axe 3. I do gain more dodge if I don't do this. What about crit chance? I think 10% crit chance is worth one armor. And 83 material. Yeah. Okay, alien eyes. Do good damage. They do steal kills, but... Right, these are easy enemies, so I don't have to take stupid amounts of damage, but a bit. I like hanging out by my turret a bit. This is when I gain my stat ups. Oh, there's trees. God, I wish you could extend just this one wave. I'd like this wave to last forever. If there was an item that let you extend waves by five seconds, this would be the character that would want that most of all. I killed the loot thing. Because of all the characters, this one gets stronger and stronger. Which is kind of good for the late game, because they do get longer in the late game. Your damage will go up like crazy. Ranged doesn't currently help me, but I do want to get that if I get the scepter. I don't know. Maybe I should have taken it. Attack speed seems really good. Regen is good. Regen is pretty good. Is it worth paying for? I don't think so. Lifesteal is worth paying for. So my dodge is 25%, mostly because of these items. They do lower my armor. What about SMG? SMG do anything for you? Kind of does. Huh. Does SMG do more than hand? I 
think it does. Minus lifesteal. Bait might kill me. Okay, we're going into wave 10 at least. I'm starting with negative 29% damage. That's really good. What about Shredder? Shredder 3, 80% chance to explode. Really, I only need... I already have a Ghost Axe 4. I don't need these other axes. Oh. I can't afford this. Also, that got rid of a bunch of my dodge. That was stupid. Why would I do that? Okay. And... I made this a difficult start to the wave. And I need to take damage early. Starting the wave with low damage is kind of bad. My damage is decent, even at the start, though. What the hell is going on with these things? Right, I have a fire turret that's, like, lighting them on fire. I need to kill that one that's sending out the range projectiles and zooming around. We did kill it. You know what? This is going well. As long as I don't die, this is going well. What if I just shift to all SMGs now? What about three SMGs? SMGs do good with damage ups. I think luck has value. I think it has a lot of value, but so does attack speed. What about mouse? Is mouse stupid? I think mouse is stupid. I'm not paying for mouse. I'm not doing it. Power generator. Power generator is amazing. Wanderbot seems pretty good. I think I like Wanderbot. Shredder 2. Sharp Bullet. Sharp Bullet is amazing. Do I already have a factory? No. It's unique. I do have two engineering. Of course I do. Okay, this is the horde. Med gun. I don't have much life steal. Med gun is not the play. SMG is the play. With no range damage. This is the horde. Before the horde shows up, I need my damage to be a little bit higher. I do have piercing on an SMG though. This round scares me normally because of those round things that are super tanky and they do good damage. But, I think my damage is good now. The axe should continue to gain me stats. Getting a red axe, I think is important. God, I really want the red scepter which I'm nowhere near getting. But you never know. All it takes is one drop, and there it is. One shot. Feeling very strong. I have 54 max HP. Level 16. Why are these all purple? Huh. I mean, armor's really good. Melee damage, but I'm kind of trying to switch to ranged. Range damage, though. I'll take some range damage. 4% speed. My speed... So right now, negative 4% damage. It worked. Zero damage. 
Holy crap, speed ups are amazing. Minus range for 12% damage. We're going to take that. Dodge for HP. It's 8 HP. For 4% dodge. I'm going to take that. Ghost Axe 2. The whole thing is, I kind of want to sell my other Ghost Axe for a ranged weapon. That's kind of stupid sounding, but I think it kind of makes sense. Let's go look at our other metal detect- or I can already see. It's only gained 106. 5% chance to double the value of materials, plus 6 luck, plus 2 engineering, minus 5% damage, 80 cost. Ghost Flint is worth locking. You're worth locking. You're worth locking. I'm not going to lock this. Maybe Metal Detector. Does it become better as you get more? I don't think so. We're not going to lock it. Never mind. All of my stats are green. Okay. Wave 12. 14 and 17 are elites. Okay. Okay. I don't even know if I can take damage now. I can. That SMG shift with the exploding gun, I think maybe that was brilliant. I should look at their damage numbers. It is going to stop the axe from scaling as much. But the axe already gained me a lot of scaling. I had the axe for the whole first, like, 10 waves doing its own thing. I actually don't know why my HP isn't dropping more than it is, but I'm not going to complain. I do have a good amount of dodge and armor. I think lifesteal is worth getting at this point. Medical Gun 3. Okay, so 69 stats gained, 3394, 23 stats gained, 13 stats gained. This one could go, but I need a good weapon to replace it with. 4927, 2325. This shredder, I have to remember, this has piercing four too. So even though it shoots a little bit slower, a lot slower. It has explosion chance and piercing. I think Shredder actually might be broken on this character. Oh. Speed is tied to damage. Wave 12. This is worth getting. Burning for 56. The burning will increase as my damage goes up, but not by much. I don't think that's worth getting. This is worth getting. So right now you do five. Now you do six. It will quickly go up. Goat Skull would be worth it if I wasn't trying to shift over to ranged. What about pencil? I don't think pencil's worth saving. Ghost Axe 2. Am I trying to get... Two Ghost Axe 4s. Not really, but it only costs 83. Okay. I get rid of this one. Maybe I am. Who knows? I guess it's just kind of like double the number of swings on the Ghost Axe. Okay. I am getting hit now, and I don't feel, like, instantly. If I just stand still, how do I do? I do spawn turrets when I kill trees. If I just stand still in this wave, I have 69 max HP. I still want um, the scepter. The Ghost Scepter would be amazing. Can't believe I haven't seen it. Losing some HP. 
kind of surprised there's nothing that like increases dodge when you're moving. Jousting Lance is the closest. Um, level 18. I want to watch. I didn't watch for level 10. I will take max HP here. I do want to watch for level 20. God, if I could find more of these alien eyes. 13,000 damage? Wait. Oh, that's throughout the entire run. That's not saying last wave. Okay. Still. That's a lot of damage. I wish the turrets showed how much damage they did. And how much healing. You've done 946. You're doing well for only having 11 luck. Two free rerolls. You know what? I'm going to take you. This one's so bad. Okay, the only reason I could see to take this, that one character where you take one damage every second and you start at one HP, this would allow you to survive that first hit, I think. I assume. One hit taken every wave. Wheelbarrow is still tempting. I'm not going to take it. What about scissors? No. What about spear? Spear probably does a stupid amount of damage. It would be stealing from my axes. Small magazine is good. Little muscly dude's not bad. Laser gun four. Has piercing two. Back back three. It's too late for piggy bank. Plus, I don't know if I really want piggy bank. I think I have to... 600% range damage. I think I have to take laser gun and just try and use that to kill bosses and elites, which I'm about to fight an elite. Okay. We'll take that in place of ghost shiv. It's pretty expensive, but... If I can get my range damage up... Right, I have to take some damage before I can really fight these. Let's bring you over to the fire turret, maybe? Okay, everything's like running away from me. I need you guys to do a little bit of damage. My guns will take out the elites, maybe, if my damage goes high enough. I am killing things. I'm not noticing that elite going down, though. Where's my med turret? Med turret is right here. Okay, I tried to focus fire it a bit. It did not work. God, I really wanted to kill an elite. Not gonna happen. If this went for another 30 seconds, I think I could have. Burning spreads. I'm going to take that. 9% speed. That's also 9% damage. I'm going to take that. Plastic explosive. You don't do explosive damage, but this does. I think I'm taking them both, which will be like all of my money. Scared sausage. I just took burning spreads. I'm going to take it. I get to reroll twice. We're definitely going to take the laser turret. <clears throat> the only thing is the laser turret does not scale its damage with my damage, but it's still good, I think. For 144, I'm going to say it's good. SMG2 is really good. These are doing damage. This is my boss killer, hopefully. I do need to get range stats. Axes are gonna fall off a bit. That's fine. We have 15. We got this. Masochist. It's too strong. Was wave 18 the next elite? I think so.
I probably could farm the big elites in this level if I let the eggs hatch. Laser gun plus explosive gun. I should look at my damage before the end. So, my damage, it's only 86%. I think I'm not taking as much damage as I would expect to. Huh. So this right now does 231. And it's done 4,700. This has done 7,799. And it only does 32 damage. Just the amount of AoE that this does. And piercing. This axe has done decent. Main thing is it's gained me 84% damage. And this one's gained me another 31%. I'm kind of surprised my damage isn't higher, especially since it goes up by my speed, too, and my speed is positive. Crit chance, elemental, minus range. Nope, I care about range damage a lot. Level 20. Do you want more lifesteal? Really tempted to just look for range. There it is. I don't know if that turret really made sense or not. I'm gonna take that. Taser 2. Taser 2 is kind of interesting. Oh, Ghost Scepter, the thing that I actually wanted. Is it too late for a Ghost Scepter? I'm gonna say no. No, it is not. I would have to give up this for it. That's fine. What about flamethrower? What about it? Too late for a crown. Um, trees die in one hit? Kind of stupid, but we'll take it. Okay, I have a lot of the uniques out of the pool. So this thing, is it actually going to get any kills? It does have piercing with minus 70 damage. Okay. The Shredder's piercing, and the laser gun has piercing. Minus 70. So the piercing is only one damage. Piercing of two damage, piercing of four damage, but explosions. Okay. Wave 17 has an elite. I want to actually kill that elite. What do I need to do to do that? I need range damage, I think. I do want to take defense too, but... I just can't get hit at this point. Eighty-two HP. The hope is that I can get 83 that Ghost Scepter tiered up very quickly so that it could start gaining me max HP. 84? Oh, one of those was a level up. Still, I think it gained me at least two stats. If it could gain three HP, that would be insanely good. I think it gained two. I mean, attack speed is nice. Scope is nice. It gained one. Triangle of power is pretty terrible. Standing still. I don't think I want the chameleon. I considered it. Wave 17, elite time. This did some damage and it still didn't gain much. How are my alien eyes doing? 
22,734. That's materials well spent. Okay, alien eyes early is a good upgrade. These things all hit hard. I'd like to go get hit by something weak, like you look weak. Okay, I'd just like to get hit, I guess. The elite is dying. I'm going to assume the laser gun is doing it. I think we get to kill this elite, as long as I don't die. Could hang out by my med turret a little bit. Twelve seconds. I don't think we get to kill the elite. Ah, it's so... It's not close. Three seconds. Try and kill it. Another ten seconds we would have had it. That's a bad sign. Is dodge worth more than max HP? I think it is. Start with one. No, it's not worth three max HP. This one's worth it, I think. Crit plus dodge, we'll take that. Burning spreads to an additional enemy. I have two of these. Ghost, scepter, three, it's kind of late. I can't afford it, I just lost 6% dodge. No. Yeah. 6% dodge. Okay. Questionable decisions. As usual. 6% dodge could be significant. Luckily, my damage is pretty crazy. Even without getting hit. I could just avoid damage. Avoid picking up the food. I still want to know what's up with these little rock looking things. They just run away from me? They're cowards? Also, why is there blue and red fire? Blue comes from the turret, red comes from me, I think. 20 seconds. I want to find that item that damages me one a second. Blood bag? I think blood bag. IV. Hey, those are elites. I can kill elites. That's what I bought a laser gun for. Adrenaline is amazing. Adrenaline might have just won me the game. Give me dodge. I want more dodge. I want the ghost scepter for even more dodge. 37%. Shredder 2. Shredder 2 is probably the correct call over Ghost Flint at this point. But I'm not going to do it. Cape. Cape actually wins me the game, I think. Too late for Vigilante, even though it's good. Barricade. I could stand still at this point. Minus speed hurts a little. I'm not going to save it. Okay, wave 19. I feel really good once I get that cape. I think we just won. Except the boss, there's going to be two bosses. I've never actually fought the bosses, two of them. I've never been this far in Danger 5. It might destroy me in like two hits. Um... As long as there's lots of little enemies that I can dodge their hits and heal five, it should be good. I wonder if I can kill the bosses instead of just running from them. They start doing a circle attack, at least one of them does. I don't know how many different bosses have I seen all the bosses in this game. I'm guessing there are three different types, and I can get two of them. Too late for harvesting. Lifesteal is good. HP regen is good. Minigun. I can't afford it. 
329, you sell for 36. You gained 25. Thank you for that 25% attack speed. It will be used on a minigun that will hopefully do stupid damage. Good piercing, good lifesteal, good knockback. This is a defensive item. Reroll when I have eight money. Ghost Scepter for... Because. We're not going endless. We're just going to win. Nice. Nice and easy. The knockback. Oh, I thought I was holding it in place. I think it just held still. Okay, I need these little enemies to do things for me. Like hit me. Okay. I did dodge that. I didn't dodge it, but my dodge skill dodged it. Okay, wait. I'm just doing damage to the bosses. Listen, you can go through the gap in that thing, but you can also just run around behind it and follow it. Okay. And as long as it doesn't reverse directions, you can just follow it forever. I think movement speed would help. Did that say mutation for the boss? Okay. These rings... I think I stay inside the ring, maybe? We have 33 seconds. One of them's close to death. Okay. Maybe just run away from it, but maybe not. My damage should be increasing. I notice I'm not really taking damage. Okay, I just took some damage. 12 seconds. I think we're killing them both. Look, chest! Get back here! One on one. Five seconds. Danger. Five. Complete. With the same character I beat. What is this? Demon. 50% of your materials are converted into max HP at the end of the wave. 13 materials equals one max HP. But you buy items using max HP instead of materials. What? Interesting. That is the final character. Not that I've unlocked all of these. So the dream with this game is to get all of the characters to have this yellow background. This character think is the strongest and easiest character. It starts with 8 armor, which is insane. It starts with 20 HP. Insane. It starts with 20 HP regen. Insane. And it starts with gain 5 damage when you take damage. All of those are crazy. It's totally worth the minus 100%. One-armed seems like it might actually be the hardest character. Renegade. I have not played with Renegade yet. Plus two projectiles. Projectiles pierce through one additional target. Plus 10% damage for every different tier one item you have. You can't equip melee weapons. Minus 400% damage. Minus 50% accuracy. Damage modifications are reduced by 80%. I mean, of course, my mind goes right to SMG. The piercing is crazy. The other thing it goes to is Ghost Scepter. Can't equip melee weapons, so I can't get the Ghost Shiv or the Ghost Axe. Huh, that one's interesting. All right, so yeah. My plan is to slowly work my way through all the characters. I do need to unlock these. I might prioritize that, or I might just get that naturally by playing. We'll see. For now, that does it for this video. Thanks for watching.